Well, this is the second part of uh, kind of going through the recent haul I got over at the uh, thrift store. We take a look over here. I also got, you know, along with all this Lego, a bunch of trash, a bunch of danged, knockoff, imi imitation, imposter Lego. What is this? We looked at this last time. It's terrible. Um, it's actually, it's a sizable amount. I'd say probably five or, I'd say probably five pounds, maybe seven pounds. You know, it's kind of hard to see in there, but there's a lot of uh, illicit Lego in there. Which is no good, but uh, still got a great haul out of this, to be honest, I think. Let me just quickly go over a bunch of it. And here's a big bag of uh, more difficult to sort parts, like tires, axles, big, big pieces, uh, burps, or big ugly rock pieces. Start organizing some of the plates. A lot of the bricks are pretty much all organized at this point. I'll start uh, integrating them back into my main collection. Here you can see I've started sorting the plates by type. Uh, I'm back here. All the Technic pieces I pulled out. I don't do a whole lot with Technic to be honest, so I kind of just throw them all into one big pile. Um, did get this really cool looking Technic truck that I might try to rebuild. I've also been able to recreate Hulkbuster. Now, unfortunately, uh, not, there are no superhero minifigures in this bulk lot. Um, somebody, I, you know, it kind of seems like someone went through and pulled out a lot of the good ones, which is okay. You know, still a lot of good bricks. Um, got this wheelbarrow, and you know how I love wheelbarrows. Let's take a quick look at what minifigs I did get. Um... There's also an Ariel who's not currently in here. Uh, you'll notice I'm watching Naruto right now. Uh, watched the sub about a decade ago, or more than that even. Checking out the dub now. If we take a look at uh, some of uh, Disney princesses, this one I think is an amalgamation of a couple from the Frozen. There's also an Ariel, but uh, she's in a different pile right now. And we got Ariel's fish. Got some Ninjago guys, got a couple of generic town folk, a couple of uh, the A is, is that, that's the most recent recent agents line. I think that's Jake Gyllenhaal Fleshhead from uh, Prince of Persia, but I could be wrong. It's a really cool robot that I don't recognize. Uh, these guys from a little game, they're actually pretty cool looking. That might be good for something in the future. But, so, nothing too great in terms of minifigs. Might try to sell the Princesses and Olaf uh, for a couple bucks piece on the eBay. Otherwise, you know, pretty satisfied. Um, but that's it. So, the haul, this, all this ended up being $70. I think I probably, I probably spent two hours or three hours alone just separating out all the junk pieces, all the Mega Blocks and Creo and un uh, copycat pieces. Um, but I'd say, you know, for the 70, seems, seems like it's pretty good value. I'm liking all these pieces, and it's, uh, being pretty good at uh, cleaning them all up and everything. The other nice, th nice thing is that, uh, they really weren't that dirty. I washed all of this. I didn't put that step in there, but I'll do a tutorial on that at some point. But, uh, you know, washing-wise, it wasn't really needed, but I'm still going to do it, of course. And anyway, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video on, a uh, current update to my lego collecting and uh finding hauls from thrift stores and uh i'll see you soon